up, everybody? Welcome back to Into the Badlands Trivia. My name's Chris. That's Mike. And what's up? Guess what? That's right. Yes. Lewis Tan. He's here. He's in Lewis the hot seat. With us. I made it. Yes. Yeah. He made it. And he's and he's in the hot seat. It's his turn to go against his fellow cast and crew Woo. and and the community in the trivia. So uh, we're gonna jump right into it. If you guys I knew don't, this day was coming. He, hey. he, he, he was dreading. It, it, that's what took so long. He was like, "Oh man." <laughs> But uh, no, Let's it's all good. Up, right? Don't worry. We do this for fun. You guys have known this is our, I believe, our 10th episode we're doing right now. I think now. so, yeah. I beat Sherman, yeah. I'm good. As long as he beats Sherman. Well, Sherman all got right, three. Well. So here's how it works, everybody. Uh, Lewis has got six questions. All right. Uh, he's going to answer them, yes or no. Or, you know, he's going to give a, a positive answer. And if he, if he can, let's see if we can get him on the board right now. Yes. You got Daniel and Paco at five. Latoya's at six. Yes. Who's uh, on the board? What was that? Who's number one on the board? Like, who's the top? Latoya top and Heather. So we got really. Latoya from from your crew and Heather from the community. They're both Damn. at six. So Damn. yeah, they... all right. Well, I don't know if I'll be Latoya, but let's see. All right, so let's 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 you know what? Let's just yeah, get into it. Let's get into it. Yes. No time but right. the present. Here we go. All right. So, like I said, right. six questions. Here we go. They're up over there. All right. So, Mikey, you got question number one? Yes, I have question number one, Lewis. Why is Gaius imprisoned by his sister? Oh, well, damn. If I don't know that one, I might as well stop <laughs> right now. Well, uh, Gaius was in uh, prison for freeing cogs. And Very... uh, uh, in one of the previous versions of the script, he actually slit the throat of one of the, uh, one of the uh, guards in order to let Minerva free. Oh. So, uh, and he was like... 15 years old when he did that so uh i think they cut that part out but okay. um but in my mind that that happened still so i i think not only did he freak uh free minerva and free other cogs but he he made his first kill when he was about 15 in 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 doing so okay. so uh there's a little a little extra bonus there and we'll, we'll nice. take it and you got it yep it. very good very Thanks good started me off easy <laughs> yeah, yeah we got you we got you uh, all right, so here we go. Number two. Oh, I got question two. All right, so season three. All right. Tilda used a fake name when she first when she first met Moon. What was that name? Oh, that's a good one. Mm -hmm. This is season three when she first meets Moon and she's pretending because he's looking for. Her. Yeah, that's right. Because she's like with the Iron Rabbit gang. Yep. Yeah, and she meets him by the uh, by that train. Oh, yep, yeah, you're I there. I remember you're that. There. I think you it was episode hint, two. Then. Yeah, I think it was episode two yeah, or so. You got so a hint and... if you need it. All right, all right, all right, all right. Give me a hint. Give me all a hint. All right, all right. The name she used starts with a C. Damn, this was hard. This is a good question, though. <laughs> but you're in there, though. See, you're right there. Your, your mind's right there. I remember there. the scene. She's standing by that train, the mm. outdoor train, and he's looking around, and he's, like, doing his scope thing, and then there was a... Uh, someone was in the was in the, uh, in the train. Uh, Daniel. Daniel yeah. was in the yeah. train, and he was hiding, and he was, like, peeping out the window, and he saw Moon, and he was like, oh, no, there's Moon, and yeah. Um, you're right there. No, nah, I forgot. I forgot the name. What is it? All right. It's Calliope. Calliope? Yeah. What kind of name is that? I know. That's a, <laughs> what that's kind a, of name is that? That's Calliope. a fake name you use when someone's that's looking a, for yeah. you. That's what that is. I would have known it. it was a lie. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Calliope, I'd be like, ain't nobody named Calliope. No one named, yeah. <laughs> all right. All right. You're, one, you're all one for two. One for two. Not bad. Not bad. All right. Question three. What is the food that Baji offers Sonny to try when they arrived at Black Wind Markets? They arrive at the market. Okay, so that's like uh, that's like uh, epi episode four or something, four or five. Yeah, something like that. No, oh, I don't even. I didn't write that down. <laughs> I think it was three. Yeah, it might have even been the third. And remember, what, there's some music going it, on right now. Was it a, was it a, is it a fruit? Why don't you give him that hint? Why don't you give him that hint, Mike? Well, the hint is it's electric. <laughs> the hint is it's electric? <laughs> electric? And he's going to eat it? Yes. It's something that Baji offered Sonny to eat. But it's electric. 
Oh That's my. That's the hint. Oh uh, no! I'm already gonna lose to Sherman. This is awful. Is it uh, what's electric that you can eat? Oh my god, I have no idea. I wouldn't eat anything electric. All right, what is it? Just tell me. It's jellied okay. eel. Jellied eel. Jellied eel. Yeah, get Electric it. Electric eel. Electric eel, yep. Yeah. Yep. That's good. Yeah. That's All good. right. All right, no problem. All right. one, you, one, you, one for three. You're down one three. For three. You got one. Yeah. You still have you still have three more to go. All right? I only went Let's to go. that set. I only went to that set to visit, so I don't know. I've never been to that set. That's a set that I've never even seen. I I, I walked through it once, but my character's never there. So right, yeah, right. yeah, yeah. Cool. All right, all right. No big. Okay, we're on question four. All right, here we go. According to Pilgrim, when he was talking with Sonny, what does he consider to be the record of our lives? What does he consider to be the record of our lives? When he's talking to Sonny, Pilgrim speaking to Sonny, and they're talking about things, and he says, this is the record of our lives. What is that? And you still have a hint. He's talking to him about the gift. He's talking to him about their past. This is like the scene. This is when they, the episode that they fought when they were kids, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, what's the hint? What's the hint? It's a type of music. The record of our lives. <laughs> yeah. No. What is it like? Oh, record of our lives in music. Is it like classical music? Give it another. Give it you another. Guys are making, you guys are making faces that don't look good. <laughs> really? I just. <laughs> I look at Chris and I just can't help but I can't. I'm, I'm always making. I'm always just like, oh no, come on, keep going. The record of our lives. What does he consider the record of our lives? The hint is, it's a type of music. Type. They're not. They're not. They're not exclusively. Yeah. The the, the hint and the the thing isn't like it's not a. You know, it's just a. Yeah, I'll tell you if you want. It's a hint. All right, give it to me. All right, it's it's our soul, our soul. What kind of hint is that? Well, that's what I'm saying. Like, I didn't soul music. Get it? Soul music. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, okay. I'm getting the feel of these hints now. These hints are like, oh, these hints are like they could be a play on words. I see. Yes. Yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah. You got me thinking. And he said soul music is a record of our lives. No, no, he said the Just soul. The soul in as, our soul. As we're trying as to think of a, we're beings, trying to think yeah. of, and you know, and it's funny, like, I didn't realize that the word record of our lives, and then we said type of music. I was like, oh, no, I just realized, like, did, oh, man, we might have confused you on that one, but, yeah. That's a good one. That's a good one. Yeah. That's All right. a good one. All right. So he That's says the soul. Theory, too. Yeah. 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 All right. No like, problem. Uh, uh, like, uh, like earth, wind, and fire, right? Right. Soul. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's true. He was quoting Earth, Wind, and Fire. That's what he was doing. Yeah. He found that in the museum. That's where they found that. Uh, yeah. Right next to right next to all the katanas that you guys were using. He's got a lot of very interesting theology, that pilgrim. Yeah, he does. and does indeed. All right. Uh, you got two more. Not a big deal. It's all, all right, good. So you only need one two more to tie. One out of four. So if all you right, get these go. two, you I can tie. Go. Bombing it. You don't need to you pretend that I'm not bombing it. I'm bombing it. <laughs> Okay. It's all, good. it's all good. It's all good. It's all fine. It's all good. You're, you're doing absolutely horrible. No. Uh, <laughs> all right. Uh, question five. In season three, Lydia reveals that Waldo was the one to find Sonny as a child. Where did he find him? Where did he find Sonny? Uh... And this is also in the comic, too. That's not your hint. You still have a hint, but... Oh no, I know this. Oh, I know this. I know this. Waldo found Sonny. He was abandoned. Um you got it, you, got it. you know it. Uh was he on a boat? I'm 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 gonna say close. Yeah. Something to do with that boat that they were on when he was when he was uh has something to do with that boat. And he left. What's the hint? Uh, the hint is the rabbit blank. That's the, the rabbit. That blank. was the location. Rabbit blank. That was the name Something. of the location. Was it like a 
rabbit blank rabbit hole was he was he in like a rabbit den rabbit hole no you said it, boat before you were close oh something to do oh was it in a cage no. was it in a boat on a boat cage on a boat <laughs> in a rabbit cage <laughs> take, 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 take a breath <laughs> <laughs> all right you give Go up on, on that one tell me. I, I don't know where where he was found by the Rabbit River. River. The Rabbit oh, River. Yeah. The river. The river. He had the medallion. That's where Sonny had the medallion. The Azra pendant. And... He found them on the riverbank. Yeah. So you were so close with that boat. That I was like, stay on that boat. Like, stay where that was. Yeah. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll see more of that. So, I mean, yeah. yeah. Obviously, you would know, Lewis. But, like, yeah, we haven't seen that yet. We haven't seen, like, where, you know, after his sister, you know, or, or whoever locked his gift and then he was found by Waldo. We don't, we don't know that. So, yeah. We haven't seen it yet. Okay. I think, yeah, I think there's some more of that storyline coming, too. All right. Cool. All right. Well, look, you got... You got yeah, one out of five. One out of, one out of five so Let's far, but we got this last one. one. Now, this is a good one. We think you're going to get it. <laughs> Don't be so sure. <laughs> I'm going to make the list regardless. It's either going to be the worst or the best. <laughs> So it's all looking right. like it's going to be the worst. Let's all right. No, no, don't worry about it. It's all good. Here we go. Last one. All right, here we go. Number six. Final question. Lewis, what does Baron Chow call Gaius when she at attempts to recruit him? What does she call him when she attempts to recruit him in the, in the first episode when you first see him? Yeah. And when you're doing your forms, that's that scene in the cage. Here's the hint. Ready? Her opening yeah. lines to Gaius. Gotta think back now. You gotta think back. Yeah, this is when I was thinking about whether or not I was gonna spit in Eleanor's face. But then I <laughs> found out that Eleanor was pregnant. Oh, for real? Yeah, she was pregnant when that happened. When I was when we did that scene, and I'm Garrett guys is supposed to spit in her face, and uh, Lewis, hold the know. camera up a little bit more towards your face, a little bit. Thank you. I've, I've done a lot of dangerous things in my life, but spitting in a pregnant woman's face. That might not have been a good <laughs> no, move. Might not yeah. have been good, right? Not have been a good. <laughs> what were her opening lines to Gaius? Her opening line. What was the opening line she said? She. I know I asked her, is mother dead? I remember that. I remember asking her, is mother dead? Right. And she, and then I say, she's, oh, so you're not here to kill me. So before yeah, that, right. before that, she asked me, what does she say when she opens that door? She says, uh, it's a good, it's a good line, too. Yeah, it's yeah. a really good line. That's why we chose it. <laughs> Something about being in my own filth. Oh no, that comes later. Yeah. Oh, we stumped you. We stumped you on this one. Go on. What is it? She says the first thing she says is a warrior with no enemy to fight. She calls you a warrior with no enemy to fight. That's right. She looks down on you. She walks no in, looks down at you. You're sitting there doing your forms and stuff, right? Yeah. Meditating. She's well, saying, one out of one out of six is not too bad. That's not bad. Hey, that's not bad. <laughs> not that's bad. all right. That was fantastic. That's all right. It doesn't matter. It's, it's all good. Great. We put you in the hot seat. It's over. Well, you know what? I, I got to say, those are good questions. So I, I appreciate the uh, the faith in me that I would have all the uh, Badlands knowledge. There's a lot to it, you know? Yeah. There is a lot to Absolutely. it. Absolutely. And it's... You know, it's it's funny. It's silly for us to you know ask you guys to remember all these little things, but that's the point. It's it's really a way to to you know showcase the knowledge and and the fandom of everybody in the community because everybody. No, honestly... it's fun. If you guys would have asked me this, you know, after I finished fi uh, filming and and doing all the uh, all the fourteen <laughs> oh. episodes or whatever, then I I think I would have been more prepared because I got notebooks and notebooks of notes. But Do the you... thing is, for me, I I like to remember things, and because I memorize so much stuff that i can't keep it all in my head you know what i mean like yeah. I, I memorize stuff for a show and then it's gone because i'm yep. the next day i'm memorizing something for a different show so it's worse yeah. yep. but you guys got me you guys got hey me. we we understand believe me a lot of the times we some of these questions chris and i are like 
like uh, we don't remember where the heck this was. Oh yeah, they get they're so deep or, sometimes we have to break yeah. them down and like and like simplify them a little bit because it's like oh those are, that's some deep cuts right there you know yeah yeah. But, there's a um, lot of there's a lot of fact checking. It's a lot to remember. Yeah. So believe me, we're with you. But uh, hey, hey, great no job. Good questions. Good job. Yeah, we hope we uh, hope you yeah. had we hope you had fun. No, it was fun. It was fun actually. <laughs> uh, I mean, cool, cool. One cool. one out of one out of six. Uh, I'm sure you you'll hear it from Daniel and Sherman and. <laughs> uh, no, they're good. Yeah. Uh, they might be yeah, little little uh, ripping coming on possibly. But uh, as long as you had fun, I you had a good what time. Daniel's questions were. Did Daniel get actually hard questions? Yeah, we we or yeah, guys let mean, him off. We gave him questions like we had one where like where was where was the room located where you had to go fight um uh the the doll that he has to go search for. He's chasing the doll through at the, the dollhouse. Yeah. yeah, well like where was that room? He's like, "What?" He's like, "Wait, hold on." He was like <laughs> thinking back to the set and stuff and yeah. yeah, it's always it's always tough, and Chris and I always say it's like some of these questions you may think are easier than others, but sometimes they get the hard ones, and they don't necessarily. Yeah, get we don't, you know, we don't know whose ones, knowledge or, is what, so we kind of try yeah, and you know, even it out. And it's like you know, again, we don't know who knows what, but you know, but it's all fun, it's all good, it's just it's just playing inside this space, and it's fun, you know. So you know, we appreciate you being a good sport for it. Um, well, I can't lie, I'm sad that I lost to Sherman, but all right. <laughs> That's all right. You know what we'll do? What, what we'll do is we, we're thinking about having head to head. So yeah, you know. like let me try again sometime with you know yeah with Sherman and maybe we'll do a head to head thing. Yeah, absolutely. We're, we're I think give it was, me another shot. Absolutely. I think it was Paco that said uh, he's like you know what we should do a buzzer thing where it's a head to head and we were like hell yeah so yeah yeah idea. give me another shot let me yeah give me another shot. All right, cool. So you got to dig out your notebooks and <laughs> you got to study up and then yeah. and then we'll, we'll get we'll give, yeah we'll give you a heads up next yeah, time. Yeah. Uh, yeah let all me right, cool. A little bit and then <laughs> and then go for it. No problem. No problem. All right, so that's it for this episode. Vent to the Badlands trivia. Um, Lewis, where can everybody find you? Tell us where they can find you on the socials. Oh yeah, if you want to uh, look at my Instagram, it's uh, Lewis Tan Official, and then uh, on Twitter at the Lewis Tan. And uh, yeah, uh, follow. You know, give me a follow if you want to check out my stuff. All right. All right, and you can follow us, of course, at Third Person on all the social medias. You can type in in Google in the search engines, thirdpersonpod.com. Let us know in the comment section below how you guys did on this trivia challenge yourselves. You want to see all the scores in there. Try to beat Lewis. Yeah, uh, don't follow me for Badlands trivia. You, know? That's, <laughs> you want to follow you guys for that. Right, right. If you want to <laughs> see, uh, see uh, you know, training videos and martial arts yeah, and stuff, then go that's ahead. Right. But if you want to learn about Into the Badlands... I'm uh, obviously not the person for that. <laughs> that's oh, you right. can. And, and, yeah, that's, and speaking that's of which, right. Lewis brings up a good point. Speaking of which, don't forget to watch our community Q&A uh, when that goes up. If it's not already up, if it is up, go check that out if you haven't already. But that's going to do it. Lewis, thank you again for being on Into the Badlands Trivia. And that's going to do it, guys. We'll see you on the next episode of Trivia. Bye. That was fun. All right. See ya.